58 is coming to Nickelodeon. So go deep. Really, really deep. <gasps> oh, yeah, you saw it right there. Not only is my daughter excited about this, adults are too. We are talking about how the Super Bowl is heading to Bikini Bottom. And that means we are welcoming to the show today the voice of SpongeBob, of course. Tom Kenny, Bill, the voice of Patrick, and Carolyn, the voice of Sandy the Squirrel. I got to tell you, I have a producer behind the scenes here. You are her childhood. She's so stoked to be talking with you, but I got to see how excited the three of you are. Did you ever think you'd be associated with the Super Bowl? Absolutely. When we did the pilot back in 97, I said, this baby's going to bring us to the Super Bowl someday. Can't wait. Yeah. I'm going to sharpen up on the rule book. But. Yeah. I, I'm telling you, Natalie. Yeah. My, my, let me tell you, my high school gym teacher never saw me appearing at the Super Bowl. <laughs> that, that, was, that was not in his bingo card. I love this. Carolyn, I'm assuming. Years. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, let's get down to how this like, is okay. going to work. Yeah? Yeah. Well, we're in motion capture. So what you see on the screen will actually be us moving. What? Yeah, and Amanda is speaking. And everyone <laughs> so should be grateful say, they're not actually seeing us in leotards and tights. <laughs> Ah, uh, I'm a little disappointed to hear that. I'm not going to lie there. Um, but I also known as my also known as my everyday work uniform. <laughs> you and I both, right? Um, yeah. Hey, Carolyn, real fast, you sort of explain how it is going to work because this is something I feel like Nickelodeon dove into a little bit last year, and and so we're kind of seeing right. the evolution of it. Truly, it, tell people what we can expect. Well, it's fun because I know Bill was the first one who did a little bit of this at a previous game, right? So Tom and I are the newbies, but yeah. um, you're going to see the game exactly the same as it's as it's airing on regular prime. We're going to be it's going to be the exact same game, but ours is going to take place in Bikini Bottom, and we're going to superimpose all kinds of graphics, and you're going to be able to see the characters interact. It's kind of a really brilliant technological adventure. So, Tom, yes. I want to get your take on this because, I mean, again, you said you knew this was just destiny for you uh, way back on the pilot episode. But with that said, is this giving you a chance to, like, ad lib and kind of improvise as the game is happening? Or are there things like, I mean, you, you're you used to, of course, you know, being a part of a script and a scripted show. So I feel like is this a, a way that you're able to show off some of the comedic chops that maybe we don't get to don't see? Don't give him any ideas. <laughs> 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 yeah, no, it's going to be fun. I mean, it, you know, obviously it's the Super Bowl, so they have a plan. They do have a plan. Don't be scared, everybody. Uh, uh, but, but uh, you know, like Carolyn said, uh, SpongeBob, Patrick, and Sandy are going to be sitting there alongside the, the – the live action sportscasters, you know, right at the table and, uh, you know, at the table and at the sidelines. And so, uh, yeah, but there is a certain, um, there is a certain ad lib aspect of it where we're, uh, we're going to be going off script and just, just being, being us, you know, or I should say being them, being SpongeBob, being Patrick, being Sandy and uh, integrating it into the game. And, and I got to say, I'm proud to help tailor uh, the sport of football to the ever shortening national attention span. It's a big honor. <laughs> <laughs> you are so right. Well, I got to tell you, um, I'm a former sideline reporter. This is like my first non-sports job. So I know, Carolyn, we're going to kind of get to see you a little bit uh, in the sideline reporting role. And I, I want to say, you know, your job's always to make it sound like the most exciting game ever, no matter what the score may be. So it's a different task there. What do you think the three of you are looking forward to most about this new and experience? Uh, something that perhaps no one else has ever seen before. As a lifetime football fan and, and experiencing this uh, a bit last year, I can tell you the, the, the liberation of, of being able to be a part of a football game while at the same time taking the gladiatorial weight off of everything and just being goofballs and having fun is delicious. <laughs> it, it's, it's, it's so much fun and it's so unusual. And everyone in the sports team from CBS enjoys it too. They're really excited about this. Uh, so it, it's, it's really extraordinary. Extraordinary. You know, I gotta say that 
the thing that What's I that? love to Oh, it's delicious. Yeah. I love that. <laughs> Tastier than a Krabby Patty. I gotta say, Natalie, the thing I'm the thing I'm most looking forward to is that uh, you know maybe Patrick will have a wardrobe malfunction. <laughs> it could happen. It could happen. I love this. I gotta tell you, I think I'm gonna be watching your feed. I'm just gonna go out there and say it. I am so glad to have you on the show. We're out of time, unfortunately. So one more time, let's go ahead and have it for Bill, Carolyn, and of course Tom. Thank you, the three of you, for being with thank us. Thank you. I cannot wait to check this Bye. out. You. you know it's Super Bowl Sunday, everybody. Check out Nickelodeon. Starts at 6:30. Take care. Have fun. Thanks. Bye. Thanks. Bye. We'll have fun.